Hey, you two vehicles here. You see where I'm at. I'm gonna find some treasure. Wish me luck. 11. Slow. Eighteen, nineteen. Ah, some piece of slow. Seven, eight. Hmm, bottle cap. Fourteen. Ah, new tab. 2425. Ah, there we go, Penny. Gonna be an old copper. 24, 25, 74. 13. Out. Ah, there we go, one nickel. Beautiful. Capital, Jefferson. Right beside of the 14. Yeah. One pull tab. Another 14. Yeah, yeah, just another pull tab. 13. Ah, another pull tab. Nineteen twenty. Coin. Looks like a zinker. Yep. 1920 Got a coin Zinker 1112 Ah Old bottle cap 19 One zinker 15 Tab. Little nine. Ah, old bottle cap. Nineteen twenty. Rusty Zinker. Seven eight. That yeah, looks like more fuel. Yep. Slow anyway. 
two to six. See what this weird item's all about. Probably an old bottle cap. Yeah, a little piece of slow. Thirteen. Ah, bottle cap, Bud Light. 15, 18, 19, hmm. Huh. Let's go see. What do we have here? Huh. It looks like one of those old hooks. Yeah, and a piece of plastic. Faint five six. Ah, it's looking like some foil. Yep, peanut butter cup. Eleven, shallow. Yeah, really shallow. Ooh, what is it? It looks neat. You see it? I see it. See that? Yeah, let's see what that is. He looks cool. Ah, just a piece of foil. 13. Huh? Old bottle cap. Bud Light, 13. It's probably gonna be another Bud Light. Yep, sure is. 20, out. Coin. Ah, just a crusty zinc. 12. May just be another bottle cap. Seemed to be in Bud Light Central. Yep, there it is. Another Bud Light. Ay, ay, ay. 17. Please be something other than a bottle cap or a pool tap. I've already dug my share this morning. Uh, zipper pool cool that's definitely better than a pool tab surface vine best find of the day so far oh he's missing a leg GI Joe no no Joe no one leg gone maybe it's here somewhere let's look No leg. No leg. 29.30. Sounding very quarter-like. I hope not. That's for sure. There it is. One quarter, 93. Look, we got something pretty. Look at it. Ooh, yeah. That looks beautiful. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. That looks incredible. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. Mm. Earring? 
Yeah, that does look like an earring. Man, that is a super heavy earring. That might be gold. Let's go check that out. Let's take it to the Higgles Wash Station. Higgles Wash Station. This is a really nice earring. Like, really, really nice. I'm hoping it's gold nice, but I don't know. We'll see. Ooh, look at that beautiful thing. Nice. Awesome. Wow. Let's get this backside good and clean so we can... Ooh, come back here so we can scope it. See if we can see any kind of marks. Look at that beautiful thing though. Uh, it's, it's fading. It might be gold plated, who knows. Let's get the scope. Well, I don't think it's gold. I don't see a mark anyway. But a beautiful little earring. Nice. Very cool. Looky here, we got another surface vine. Yeah, look at him. Wow. Tarantula. 25. Don't sound deep at all. Right here in this little vole hole. In my hand. That's ah, just an old penny. Gonna be copper though. 1920. Coin. Crusty zinc. 26. I don't think we've still found a silver coin out here yet. This one's super shallow. There it is. Modern dime. Little weird 21, 22. Probably a bottle cap. I don't know. We'll take a coin. Penny. Nice. Hmm. We got something weird right here. Might be a toy. Might be like a car or something. Well, I see rust. Rust is no good. Weird. Cool, something else. I always like that. See, there's something right here too. Let's get rid of this so I can sit my pen pointer down. Ah, this is a pool tab. Oh, that's my buddy. Hey man, how good, how are you? Good. Good. Ah, not really. <laughs> <laughs> Video, uh, found, uh, was that like a black onyx? Like class ring, an old black onyx ring you got? It was. The black onyx? Uh huh. Ring. That was big back in the day, my granddaddy had one. Yeah, it had a, it's older. Yeah. Um, and I think it had like a, an M on it, I think. Yeah, that's what granddaddy's was. It was a black on it. 
I mean, he had it when he was little. Yeah. He was born. Yeah. It's been over. Yeah, he's been about over 100 years old now. Oh wow, yeah. My granddaddy. He was. He, he wasn't a real big guy. It barely fit on my little finger. Yeah. I think it was. I know his granddaddy's because his grandmom gave it to me. Right. Uh, and then uh, I gave it to my boys. I still have it, but it's Jamie's. Sure. But uh, it's it real little, but it reminded me of that one. Well, this one's gold. That one looked like it was. Sterling silver, ha uh ha, -huh, it is. But I saw that black on it. I thought, that's similar to what? Yeah, I found a little earring earlier. That's the only really great thing I found so far today. Um, a couple weeks ago, I returned a golden ruby ring to a gal that I found out at uh, Gum Street School in Boonville. Really? Yeah, it had three initials in it and it had her graduating year 1990, so I took it to the school board. And they looked her up and they contacted her and she contacted me and we were able to get back together. That's a real big deal in the metal detecting community to be able to do a recovery and get something back to somebody that they yeah, lost. So like we find cell phones out here. Yeah. And we we find billfolds and different stuff and it, usually they got their ID or the, the phone usually somehow I, my daughter can figure out how to yeah. get it. And we usually get them back. Sometimes uh, they're busted up and broke. Uh, now, do you know that there used to be an old homestead on here? Like back in the 1800s, about back oh, here in this corner? Way back before I know. I don't know the history of it. I looked up on a map, 1905 and 1865, and it shows a black box kind of back here in this area. I didn't know if maybe you knew where, oh, where it might have been. We got this. And There's all kinds of slag and old stuff they're, they're, up there and it showed there was another one way up in the very corner and up in the very corner the other day i found an old shotgun slug from the 1920s huh. so i was getting pretty close up in that corner yeah well finding some old white lead and an old shotgun slug and you know some real old dated pieces but <laughs> well it was good talking shop with you Talk to yep Twenty six. Should be a dime. There we go. Do have a coin. Modern dime. I'm gonna do a couple more rows back here in the back. Now I think I'm gonna head up front to the older portion. See if we can't find an old silver out here. Well, we got something cool. Don't know what it is yet. Ooh, spray bottle, sweet. Little perfume bottle, nice, cool. It's a 1920, but it's, sounds like it's something big. Ah, bottle cap. Hmm, cool, I still got something down here. Coin, old zinker. Anything else? Twenty-nine thirty. Don't you dare. Oh, Ninety-five. All right. I do love the drive-in because there's just all sorts of variety. 
I don't know if this is some kind of old alternator or something. Who knows? This thing, uh, they tell me, used to sit on top of the poles and then the speakers hung off of these. Um, this weird item, it's not metal. I'm not sure what it is, but it's got, it's got all kinds of fancy on there. So that thing's kind of cool. A little perfume bottle. He's kind of cool. We got the big spider. Yeah. Uh, a couple of vapes. Uh, bubbles. Blistex. We got a comb. Battery. You know, all that fun stuff. Big old giant pile of clad. We got the G.I. Joe with the Kung Fu grip with the one leg. And then this thing's cool. This thing might actually be old. Not sure about him at all. And then the find of the day was, of course, this little earring. I don't think it's precious, but it's very cool nonetheless. I didn't see any marks, but it's definitely an earring. You can see the post. Anyway, that's my hunt. I'm B. Higgles. I'll see y'all on the flip side.